Good morning, all you wonderful peoples. All, you know, two of you, I guess. Um, we're inspecting the garden today. Look at that. Aren't those the prettiest cabbages? And there's my garlic that the stupid squirrel ate all the greens off of. Didn't eat them. Just chewed the greens off and then left them there, like adding insult to injury. But they all seem to be coming back, so... And my poor three little old carrots over here. It's a good thing carrots are not real high on our list of things that we like. I mean, we eat them, but they're not, you know, vital like turnips over there. But I'm out here getting my vitamin D, walking around in my garden and shaking like a fool. Let's see if we can't get this turned around soon. Yeah. I'm out here sucking up vitamin D this morning, and I thought I would talk to y'all, because why not, you know? Um, I've noticed, I can't see my camera because of the glare, so if I'm out of focus, I'm sorry. Um, I've noticed that a lot of preppers are using the phrase, put your house in order, get ready get it done, get it, you know, stacked, stocked, all that stuff. Um, and a lot of us are out of resources or are out of space. Or if you're like me, what I'm desperate to stock right now is freedom seeds and psh, yeah good luck with that right so I'm going to take today to literally get my house in order because even if my house was as fortified as Fort Knox it's also my home and ultimately, that's what I'm trying to defend, is my home. Um, this is where we live. This is our castle. So today, I am cleaning house, getting my house literally in order. I think I'm going to spend the next week doing that. That's the plan anyway. Um, I'm starting on the kitchen today. I am literally going to scrub the kitchen from the ceiling down to the floors. Baseboards, windows, everything. I'm going to uh, condition all my cast iron. I'm going to put my kitchen in ship shape so that it's ready for whatever comes. Then will come the dining room. Then will come the living room. Then will come the bathrooms. Then will come the bedrooms. Um, part of the reason behind that is because I'm anxious and any of you who have any issues with anxiety will understand this there's too many things out there that I can't control and they're dangerous things they're scary things and I have no control I can't stop them I can't avert them oh my gosh I'm tearing up I can't can't do anything. So, I'm focusing on what I can do. You know, if my house is going to become, let's face it, my prison if they put us in a hundred days worth of lockdown. Um, 
God, I don't know what's going on today. Um, and poor Weezer's over here trying to make me feel better. Um, if my house, if, you know, if I'm truly going to be locked in, damn it, it's going to be clean. It's going to be in order. It's going to be a pleasant place to be. Um, you know, I keep laughing and telling y'all, I've got an extra bedroom. There's places for sleeping mats on my floor. Y'all all decide to run away and join Texas. Um... And if it comes to that, you know, those places on the floor are going to be clean. The bathtubs will, the toilets will be scrubbed. That's something I can control. Something I can do. Something that I had the skills and the means and the ability to take control of. And to make right. And to fix. So... If you are like me and you're crawling the walls, if you are like me and you feel like your skin is covered in ants, if you are like me and you're anxious, find something you can do. Something you can make a difference in. You know, if it's Sweeping out your garage, great. If it is, uh, you know, matching up all your socks, great. If it is, you know, scrubbing your grout with an old toothbrush, go for it. Because if things are going to get bad, which, come on. If, that's an awfully small if, that one's not even a big one. Um, we might as well make sure that our environment is a pleasant one. So yeah, find something you can control. And control it. You know, find something productive that you can do. And do it. Because... Not everybody's a warrior. Not everybody's... I mean, we may all be patriots, but we're not all warriors. And, you know, those of us that are... Backing those who are warriors. We need to get our house in order, too. So, this is a really weird video today. I'm going to battle my anxiety. with a dust rag and a mop and a broom and a scrub brush and damn it when I don't think that the shit has really hit the fan but I think it is definitely in flight to hit it And by golly, when it collides, my house is going to be clean. So, y'all be safe. Y'all, <laughs> normally I say be at peace, but my peace is wandering around. <sighs> it's played in hide and seek in my brain right now. Um, but yeah, keep... Keep your calm. Find your calm. Wear yourself out until you can sleep through your anxiety. Do whatever it is you need to do. To hang in there. So, I love you guys. And I will see you next time.